Blaine Baldwin. I'm a 13-year Eden endorser. Been the special projects coordinator for about three years now, and a personal friend of David Nordskow, our founder, and that's why I came to work for him. Right now, I'm going to show you all the new gear for this year. On top, it was G Wiz just a year and a half ago that we released the WTX 260 micro amp, 3.8 pounds. This one is only 4.3 pounds, and that extra half a pound gets you double the wattage. This is the WTX 500. And I'm going to tell you what, all of our endorsers have lined up to order this to use it as a fly date amp. If we go left to right, input gain has a 12 dB pad, again, for active bases. Uh, on the enhance, you pull to bypass the compressor. And what we teach people to do is to bypass that, set your level using that light, then you put the compressor back on and it'll operate only on the loudest notes. If you want a little more compression, then you dial in more gain. Next you have the bass control, but also the pull for bass boost. This is the dynamic boost circuit from the time traveler. Over here again, the mid shift, 550 and 2.2K. Then on the high, you have pre-post select for the DI. You pull for post EQ. Standard position is pre-EQ. And then the master is the only thing that doesn't have a pull function on there. Down here, we have the mute to tune. It is a full mute now. Uh, it also mutes the DI out of the back. Effects send and return. Left and right aux inputs are summed to mono. The tuner out uh, is the only output that is not affected by the mute. Okay. Now, yes it is. The foot switch is a two piece, or a two button rather, and it's uh, enhanced bypass and mute to tune. Okay. Now if we whip it around real quick, by the way, the fan, totally unnecessary. The thing has never gotten hot enough to have to kick it on, but David didn't want to put one out without a fan just in case. Now on the back, we have the foot switch. Here's the power switch back here. DI with ground lift and level control. Headphone out uh, can also be used to slave to another amplifier. And then you have speak on and quarter inch outs. 4.3 pounds, 500 watts at four ohms, self-correcting world voltage. So anywhere you go in the world, you get a cord with this end for the amp and the proper end for the, uh, for the outlet at the wall. When you plug, plug the amp in and turn it on, it wakes up and says, wait, where am I? Oh, I'm in France, and sets it up for the, the French voltage. If the next night you're in Germany, it says, oh, I'm in Germany, and it sets it up for German voltage. There's nothing you have to do other than turn the amp on. So many of the endorsers, when they found out about it, called me and ordered it. We didn't even have the pricing in. They didn't care. They just knew that they were going to be touring Europe. Uh, Uriah Duffy uh, went through Japan and Australia, um, South America, worked perfectly.